I believe I updated the whiteout number off screen and we should be on run number 13. So it should be 12 whiteouts. Yes. Okay, cool. Run number 13. Any voters? You got three votes, two for Trico, one for Mudkip. Any last second voters? It's looking like a Trico dub. Our first Trico run, everybody. Sheet Ghost said that he would be the starter this time. And so it is going to be, we got it, we're good. This is the run, by the way, everybody. This is the run. This is the one where we beat it. The man is just staring at you and watching you fail. <laughs> I'm just sitting here like, come on, man. He's just, he's just looking at me like. No, you dead ass. Like <laughs> it's level three. All right. Like, come on. Oh crap, what I missed, sorry, was playing some XD on GameCube. What are you laughing at? What are you guys laughing at? Why do you guys keep typing XD? What is our Pokemon? What do we get here? What do we get? Lots of good Pokemon we get in Viridian Forest. Any extra Johnsons? We get a Wurmple. Um, kind of a bad encounter, but it's fine. Do we name it Extra D? Is that... <laughs> I feel like that is fitting. Nuzzles your necky wecky, mer he he, winky face rubbies your dot 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 dot. Mm. What do you mean by that, dude? Look at <laughs> look at Trico. Just <laughs> he's flapping his wings, but he can't fly. Give me something. Okay, Makuhita. Not the worst. Not the best, but not the worst will help us with the Nugget Bridge battle. All right, Brock, here we go. Sandy Cheek just absolutely dominates here. I'm gonna go for an Absorb, get some health back. Absolutely dominate. Yeah, I mean, we're just, it's just easy. Sandy Cheek basically just wins us the whole fight. That was huge. Aqua Jet, GG. PP up is fine. PP up? Any PP uppers? Any uppies for the PP? That's just not a question that I should ask. The goal today is to get past Surge and potentially back to Erica, but we're going to make sure we play it safe, okay? We're not going to throw another run. I know I've said that for 12 runs, <laughs> but this is the one where we actually make it happen. It is time for this fight. I feel pretty good about this. Uh, we have the moves we need. We have the Pokemon we need. Should be in a good enough spot here to make this work. So the Growlithe comes out first. It's a little bit annoying. We want to see if he switches out. He doesn't. Goes for Dragon Rage. Okay. I imagine he's going to switch into Togedemaru here. So I'm just going to go for a strong Aqua Tail. Oh, goes for Gabite. That's a huge play. Why would you do that? You're throwing. Oh my god, you're th why would you do that? What a throw! I just win that outright. Wow. Why would you go into Gabite there? It's just such a terrible play. You have a Togedemaru. What? <laughs> okay, sick. So Gabite's out of here. Great. Excellent. Very nice. Togedemaru comes in. Uh, we do not have to stay in here. Now we can go into... We have a couple of options here. Mostly, I want to intimidate it to shreds. It's going to go for an electric attack first. So we're going to go for Sandy Cheeks here. I don't think it stays in here. It'd be kind of a throw if it did. Either way, nothing can really switch into a mud shot. Oh, this is fine. Are you going into Kamala? That's totally fine. Kamala literally can't hurt my this Pokemon, so we're good. Rowlith comes in, we can just mud shot. Ooh, hold on, let's play smart. Let's play smart. That was great damage. We're sending bands here for force palming. Easy kill, nice. Here we go. Misty fight, usually doesn't give us too many problems. Should be okay here. We just need to make sure we have Grovile for fighting against the Lantern and we should be fine. Maybe get a pretty free kill here. Almost. We're gonna go for a sucker punch. Nice. I think it's going to go for Scald, and I don't really want to switch in anything to a Scald because I don't want anything to get randomly burned. So we're going to go for Poison Jab to see if we can't get a burn. Or not a burn, a uh, a poison. If this doesn't kill, I think we kill it. Holy shit. Yes, Slitherpeen. Yes. Huge kill. Huge kill. Floatzel comes in. 
we just go for Sucker Punch at this point, just for chip damage. Holy shit, that did a lot of damage. Oh my god. Wait, we're cracked. Slitherpeen's just so good. The reason we go for Bite instead of Thrash is to force. If it tried to switch out, it would have been forced into taking a super effective Bite attack. So now Gyarados has done its job. We can... Uh, this does not have an electric move, so we should be able to get off a Bite here before we die. I don't think this one shots. No. We're, well, yeah, we're good. We actually might beat it with Gyarados. Because now we can just go into Sheet Ghost, go for a Mega Drain, and just stall it out like that. Easy peasy. This is, of course, named The Run. This is like, I don't even know which time. This is like the sixth time we've got it. So The Run V6. <laughs> there we go. Here comes Umbreon. <gasps> what the fuck? Why is it a Sylveon? Why are you Sylveon? Why? What? Why are you Sylveon? Baby doll eyes? Dog, are you dead ass? Is that why? I didn't know that. I never I never used a Sylveon. That's how it, dude. Oh God, man. That just sucks. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. It's not what I wanted, but it's fine. We are going to go for Air Slash. Okay, we do move first, which is good. Good to know. Could have gone for Leaf Blade instead, but it's fine. Good damage. Air Slash might kill here. Oh, big kill. Huge kill. Actually massive. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. Oh, this is going perfectly. Excellent start. Get all that health back. Huge. Oh, my. Oh, yes. It's so strong. Yeah, what's up, Wigglytuff? You want some of this? You like this proboscis? I think you do. It's nice and long. Nice long proboscis. Poison fang the fuck out of this thing. And we just win. This should kill. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's a dub. That's just a dub. Just a massive fucking dub, dude. Just a huge dub. Oh, my God. Okay. We're, we're about as prepared as we could ever be. We're going to hope that we don't get shit on here. Big battle for the run. We could sucker punch here, but I think he switches. Maybe not. We're going to sucker punch anyways. Yeah, okay. Cool. Guaranteed kill on Cramorant. Needle Queen comes in already. That's a little concerning. Just going to make sure. That oh, it has Storm Drain. That's right. Forgot about the Storm Drain on the Lilith. That is annoying. Okay, so Gyarados is dead here. <laughs> Should have just double Ice Fang. Ooh, big flinch though. Huge flinch. Okay. Gyarados is dead. It's fine. Ooh, never mind. We're better. We're just better. Holy shit, we're better. So far, so good. It's Gastrodon and Luminion. Gastrodon comes in. We Sucker Punch and we Leaf Blade. Oh my god, yes. Kill. Kill, come on. Even with the berry. Come on. Four times effective. Kill it. Yes. Clean fight. Okay. <sighs> clean. Very clean. Very good. We're looking for a big encounter here in Rock Tunnel. Need something good. Hopefully something ground type related. <laughs> Please. Please. Uh, that doesn't help. That doesn't help. <laughs> that does nothing for us. The problem is, okay, here's the problem. In my brain, I want to lead with bands so I can belly drum and then just try to like go huge. But the problem is the, the Pinchurchin can potentially either paralyze me or burn me. And if that happens, we're in a tough spot. I almost feel like Belly Drum is too risky. It's so hard to say. Time to fight Surge. The hope here is that we can bulldoze once, knock it out of here, and then we're good. My concern is that he might just switch out directly, which would suck. The defense rising also sucks. We just have to go for it though. Does this one shot? <laughs> Not quite. It didn't bull switch though. No paralysis. This should kill. Are you for fucking real? I don't know how that doesn't two-shot. It's so annoying. We at least get that off the field. All right, Manectrite comes in. It is very likely going to go for an electric attack here after it mega evolves, which is always really annoying. Its defensive stat is pretty bad, but we just got intimidated. So I think we go into the run here. There's no way it's using Hidden Power Grass here. That'd be 
Absolute throw. So I doubt it's going to want to stay in here necessarily. It's probably going for Hidden Power Grass here. This is where Bands could switch in and make a play. And by Bands, I mean Bands 2.0. I do not know what the play is here. I know it's not going to go for a fire move, but I don't think Sheet Ghost can switch into a Mega Evolved attack like that. So what I can do is probably tank a hit and go for Confuse Ray. Because this isn't going to kill. It's going to do a lot, but we can switch into a Volt Switch later and get that health back. So it's probably going to go for a Flame Burst here. I don't know. It might switch into Bolt End or something. I don't really know. But we need to force the switch out. If Okay, this is good. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. It's a little sketch. It's a little sketch. Okay. Oh, we need this to do a lot of damage. Big damage here. Huge damage here. Okay. Lowers the speed. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Or just hit me. That's fine. Nice. Okay, now it's probably going to go for Hidden Power Grass again. And what do I even do? Its speed is lowered. If it's going for Hidden Power Grass, it could probably pull off a dig here. Let's try this. If it's going for Hidden Power Grass again, then we tank this. Please hit yourself. Just hit yourself. Just hit yourself. Nice. Okay. Now this is a test. Are we faster after that first bulldoze? No. Okay, this is good to know. This is going to hurt. I don't think it one-shots. Okay. If this doesn't kill, it at least lowers the speed enough, I think. Either way, we have Sucker Punch. Please. Nice. Okay. Big threat off the field. Boltend comes in. This thing is the worst. This thing will one-shot me if I do not intimidate it. I don't know what move it's going for. I imagine it's probably going for Thunder Fang. As long as it's not Psychic Fangs, the run can tank it. It is Thunder Fang. We heal from this. It's good. I'm going to go for it. I don't think this one shot. It's not. Nice. Okay. We actually tanked that pretty good. If it's going for that again, we can go into Mighty Anna here. Or we could even go into Bands here. If that's what it's going for, we go into Bands. Bulldoze goes huge here. Maybe even kills. That's fine. We go back in. If he's going for Thunder Fang, we go back into the run. Nice. We heal up a bunch of health. He's going to go for Psychic Fangs here. We can completely negate Psychic Fangs by sending in Bark e -thoughts. Cannot hurt us. We go for Sucker Punch. <sighs> nice. Vika Volt, big threat. This is the last, like, really big threat for our team. It is likely going for a Bug-type attack here. We do not have anything that can tank this Bug move very effectively. We, I think, have to let Bans die here. Now we are faster. It's important to note we are faster. We could go for a Fire Fang here, but then we lose Bark Ethos for sure. Hold on. Might not need to do that. We sack bands here to see what it's going for. That's the play. That's the best play we can make here. Okay, Bug Buzz. That's what I thought. It doesn't kill us. We might outspeed. We may maybe get a Rock Tomb off. Oh my god. Huge play. Huge play. That's big. Oh, that's so big. Okay. Because now we outspeed for sure, and now we can kill a Fire Fang. 100%. 100% kill a Fire Fang. It is massive. Oh, actually, maybe it doesn't kill because I forgot about the berry. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Guaranteed kill here with pretty much anyone on our team. It's fine. We have four Pokemon to deal with, basically one. Get the guaranteed kill. Just the Alolan Raichu. We can go for Dig here. It does outspeed, which is cringe. I don't think it one-shots. Of course it's a crit. Of course it's a fucking critical hit. It's fine. It's actually fine. We go Bands here. And then we hope we can do a Bulldoze before we... Okay, it's a little scary, but the Bulldoze here is huge. That actually might have been good for us. Holy shit. This is fine. 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 I think we actually guaranteed win here. We guaranteed win. It's a guaranteed win. All we do is press Sucker Punch and win the game. Holy fuck, dude! Finally! 
Oh, it's been so long. Finally. We've gotten past Surge again. Holy shit, dude. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Yes. Oh, we finally did it. We finally, finally got past fucking Surge again, dude. God, that was driving me crazy. And we had 69 health when we did it. <laughs> oh, baby. It's the run, boys. This is the run. We have a lot of work to do to prepare for Erica. That's for sure. I'm just glad we got past Surge again, man. I'm just really glad we got past Surge. Second time ever. <laughs> The big boy. The big one. There he is. Oh yeah. Okay. More Grim. Um, Grimmsnarl's not a bad Pokemon. I don't know if it necessarily helps us in this gym, but it's a good Pokemon. I don't know where the item is in there, so... <laughs> oh, I can get an encounter here, though. Route 16. A Durant? This thing would be gross for Erica. It's like the perfect typing. Yeah, this one has to be named Kevin. It, it's just... It's... It, it literally is required. Holy shit, I got another Eevee. Wait, this is our moment. This is what we needed. I can... I can not fuck it up this time. <laughs> um... Chesto. Give me ten of these fuckers. So I'm not underprepared. I can subtract EVs from a Pokemon. Oh, that's kind of huge. I can just take all the EVs off of Pokemon. I can actually EV train here if I wanted to. Then I believe you can go in here. Oh, fucking, I forgot about Morty. Uh, it's not that one. Yeah, so I can pay for EV training services and I just get like free EVs. Terrible investment. Dude, I, I don't know what I'm fucking doing, man. Uh, it's fine though. This is why it's the 13th run. I need you to relax. Yawn the thing I don't do in a brassy dude stream. Is that true? Has nobody ever yawned in this stream? That's actually crazy. Zero yawns have happened. Because of this high octane exhilarating content, right? Holy shit, here comes Malamar. Here, I'll do the cry for you guys. Boy! That's what it sounds like. All right, it's like close enough. What are you guys, what? What's wrong? What? That's what it sounds like, dude. I don't know what to tell you. That's exactly how it sounds. Look up right now. All of you that are questioning me, Google right now. Google what, 34 Melamar? Uh, yeah, so if you look up, it's the 34th Pokemon in the deck. So if you look up 34 Melamar, safe search off on Google, then you'll find exactly what I'm talking about. Here we go. Rillaboom is up first. Chat, we go for Bug Buzz. I love that it just went for Grassy Glide. That's huge. That is huge for us. Oh my God. If it goes for that again, this is perfect. Oh my God, the damage. Wait, holy shit. Dude, that's massive. I don't know why it went for Grassy Glide. Okay, Superior comes in. Listen, this is fine. <laughs> this is fine. What is it? It likely goes for Hidden Power Fire here, okay? This could be a moment for Toxapex to come in and do some serious damage. The problem is it likely goes into Venusaur right after that. It could go for Leaf Storm, though, and that would be a problem. If we go for Quiver Dance, though, we probably outspeed after that and then would be stronger could maybe go for a Bug Buzz. Because it didn't go into an Electrode, and that's why I'm confused. Why would you not go into an Electrode here? I think we gamble the Quiver Dance. I'm doing it. Okay, it went for Hidden Power Fire. That's good. Shouldn't one-shot. Oh! <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh, okay. <laughs> good Lord. All right, but now... Oh, it's faster! No, I thought one. Ah! I thought one quiver dance would be enough. Oh. Okay. 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 Uh. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's totally fine. I thought one quiver dance would get our speed up enough for that. Apparently not. We need to think of our next move very carefully. 
because our Venusaur counter is now off the field. <laughs> our biggest Venusaur counter is gone. That really sucks. Bands, you are insane if you think I can just spam a Lava Plume and win this. Just doesn't work. <laughs> It just doesn't work, man. Yeah, Venusaur getting rid of the Toxic Spikes is our biggest hurdle right now. So we need to think about how we get Venusaur off the field so Toxapex can win us the game, you know? All right, here's the vision. We go into Swag Torch here, okay? We force Superior's hand. We go for Lava Plume. It goes for Leaf Storm. This is a little scary, but... Okay, does this one shot. Not quite, okay. Oh, the big burn, huge burn. Okay, huge burn, huge burn. Oh, it's a massive burn. Okay, 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 okay. If it's just going for Leaf Storm, we go into Kindling. Now we go into Kindling. Leaf Storm's not gonna do jack shit and we'd be able to outspeed. It's quite effective, but the burn, it nullifies that boost it just got. That still did quite a bit, but we're fine. Cause we are faster than this thing. How, how are you faster? How, I. How are you faster? I think we just lose. I don't, I don't think there's anything I can do here. With that many leaf storm boosts plus grassy terrain out. Like, bands maybe tanks one? Stall with Regenerator till burn kills it. The burn's not gonna kill it. The grassy terrain's still out there. We can't just keep tanking Leaf Storms. Wow. Just wow, man. That's how this run dies. That is so unfortunate. I'm... All of that just to lose to fucking superior because it outspeeds. Would paralyzing it help? Yes. Paralyzing it would help. Plus having Sucker Punch would have helped a lot. So Arbok would have been a better play. The fact that the Rillaboom didn't switch out just threw me for a loop. I didn't know what to do. I was not prepared for the Rillaboom to just stay in and get killed by Bug Buzz. Like, why would you just throw away your Pokemon like that? Like, I was fully expecting, like, if that was the case, I would have just set up Quiver Dances. I would have just set up Quiver Dances and Roosted, you know? Well, now we know, in the event that we are in a similar spot, we just go Quiver Dance. They do have EVs, yeah, I just still thought a fucking Town Flame would outspeed a Superior. I needed to change the ability of Kindling, and I needed to change the ability of Slowbro. That also needed to change, but I, I just needed more priority there. I needed to be able to outspeed. We were at this point with Surge before where we thought we just, there was nothing we could do, but we could have played that better. Could have played it better.